Hello. So we are back, same Wednesday, yeah? Every day is more close from Friday, you know? Okay, let's speak today about something that people ask for a long time, you know? How those MOSFETs are working? How we can check the MOSFETs, yeah? And it's not easy. And it's very confusing, yeah? You know that with the transistors, was easily you know you have 0 0.6 volts on the, between the, the the base and the emitter and the transistor it get open you know the MOSFET is not so easy because uh, if the transistor it's open by current the MOSFET is open by voltage you understand so on the MOSFET case the current is not important open by voltage this is a weird thing, you know, because it can be open even by touch. Touching the gate, yeah? So let's go on the MOSFET signal, yeah? Symbol. MOSFETs, yeah? That's the MOSFETs, yeah? We have drain, source, and gate. If you have, to, if you want to make uh, like a bridge with a transistor, the drain is the collector, the source is the emitter, and the gate is the base. Yeah? Same thing, yeah? But they are not working the same. They are acting like switches, same like with the transistor, but the MOSFETs, they are carrying more current. That's why in these days, all the industry is moving from the transistor to the MOSFETs. Yeah? So, let's... Uh Let's draw our schematics, yeah? Our schematic. Yeah. What do we have today here? We have uh, a MOSFET. Ah, sorry, it's not, it's not round, but anyway. We have the gate. That's the gate. And um, we have the drain. On the drain, we have few LEDs, yeah? Uh, anyway, you can, yeah. Okay, we have few LEDs. Lighting emitting diode. And these go to plus. That's plus. And the other thing, the source, yeah? is ground, is going to minus that's what we have here, this is a, a channel N so channel N according with the new standards the, the arrow is like that I know it's weird I spoke about this thing before so that's what we have here on the desk yeah so let's have a look mm. Okay, let's go under the microscope and study what we have here and how we can test it. And the microscope is not on. Let me put it on the microscope. Trust me, it's weird. And basically you cannot use the MOSFET how it is. I will explain you why. One second. So we have the LEDs, I, uh, I need more, hmm. and we have the MOSFET, let's see first the MOSFET, yeah, that's a laptop MOSFET, it's a usual laptop MOSFET, 4496, I think we can find his datasheet on the internet, one second. Let me see if I can find MOSFET 44969696 and channel Okay, I think it's this one. Yeah, it's this one, yeah. 
So that's our MOSFET. And also has a diode, low gate, uh, low gate charge, and channel up to 100 volts. Yeah, drain source voltage 100. Gate source, so you, you, you can uh, plus minus 20. So the, 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 the voltage on the gate can be 20 volts. Amps, 30 amps, that's unbelievable for something like that. So you see, even the MOSFETs from the laptops, you can find them on uh, on, uh, on Google. Okay, good. And according with this one, you see all these pins are drained, yeah? All these pins free are source and one is gate. Exactly our configuration, yeah. So again we have the plus here. That's the plus, that's the drain. All four pins are together, yeah. Source is minus. Three pins are together and we have the gate, yeah. How can I do it for you to see the LEDs? Like that? Yeah, maybe like that. Now we have around 8 volts we can see there. Let's touch. No, let's check. Let's power off the, the power supply and check with the multimeter on diode mode. The MOSFET, yeah? Drain and source. Because that's what you will check. If it's on short or not. Ah, okay, we can't see them. So it's nothing, you can see, look on the multimeter, it's on diode mode, that's short, if I touch this together, so it's nothing, yeah, nothing. If we we'll, if we'll, we'll spin the, the probes, what you can check now probably is the diode from inside of the MOSFET, you know, you have 0 0.5, yeah, okay, clear, okay, let's power up the power supply, yeah. We need to see the LEDs, yeah? Let's touch, I'll touch with the tweezer, the gate, yeah? Because on this one, it's no important the current are open by voltage. Uh, one second, I think I missed something. Yeah, the power supply is off, sorry. Again, MOSFET, LEDs, so you can experiment yourself, yeah, let's touch the gate. Huh? The LEDs are on? Now are staying on. So now the gate is charged. Let's power off the power supply, yeah, quickly. And check our MOSFET. Let's check the MOSFET. Again, same thing on the diode mode. So check there. 0 0.043. That looks like a short. And you will think the MOSFET is on short. You can see? So now checking the MOSFET. Checking the MOSFET, you'll think the MOSFET is on short. Because it's open. To close the MOSFET, you have to short the gate. And the source. If you short them together, now the gate is discharged. And now if we check with the multimeter, it's not short. Now that this is the diode and on the other side, it's closed. Yeah, so it's not open anymore. So you understand how sensible these things it is. 
So if you if you understand, yeah. Look, here you have the LED. I don't have to put any voltage. Of course, you can put voltage. Look, when I touch and I touch with with with, uh, with the hand with the tweezer, yeah. No voltage on this. Let's try to open this and. Okay, now 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 you see it's weird. So I have to touch few times, and now it's open. Now the LED is on. To to shut down the MOSFET, yeah, I have to short the gate to the source. Yeah. So you can see now it's close again. Now it's on. You can see the light on. To close it, I have to short the to source that's why you can't use a MOSFET how it is normally any schematics they have a resistor from gate to source on all the schematics and on that case yeah you can use the MOSFET but otherwise it's it's is doing random things like it's opening or it's staying open, things like that. Let's try again. Now it's open, yeah? Let's shut down the power supply. Shut down the power supply. And let's check with the multimeter. Yeah, with the multimeter. On the diode mode. Look, it's short again. You can see? So now you'll think, yeah, if you take out the MOSFET from the motherboard and you check, you see, you'll say, no, it's a short. No, it's not. It's just open. And to close it, to close it, you have to short the gate and the, and the source. Okay, shorten this. Now it's fine. Now it's not short anymore. Okay? Okay, I'll stop now. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you like the video. And see you later, yeah? Bye.